Uh, currently, we are the number one team in the nation. Um, after shooting the Army National Championship down in Fort Benning, Georgia. Okay, you do your last five minutes. Now let the Load. Start. Probably one of the best things about uh, air rifle. There's not only a competition uh, with the other team or against the other team, but also amongst the team. The kids are fighting for first place as a team, but they're also fighting as first place as an individual to be ranked number one overall. Wherever we shoot and all the matches we've shot in this year, we have shot no lower than third place, mm -hmm. and quite often taken the number one slot. Wow. So the national rankings actually comes from the civilian marksmanship oh. program. Okay, is that a compilation or is it just from that one event? Uh, it's just from that one event. Okay. So this week we could be on top of the world. <laughs> and if my kids are not shooting good, then the ranking is going to fall. Well, I grew up, you know, shooting twenty twos and stuff, but. Shooting air rifles. This is my fourth year. Like I started my freshman year in ROTC. How, what does it take to be a, a, a top ranked shooter like you are? Lots of practice and lots of dedication to the team. How, how much would you say you practice? We practice at least nine hours a week. When I first started shooting air rifles, I wasn't too good. But then I started coming to practice a lot more and practicing a lot more. And then Chief helping me out and making sure I'm in the right position and... So good coaching helped quite a bit yeah. too. Did you ever think when you started this four years ago that at some point you would be ranked in the number one team? No, never. <laughs> I never thought we would. Uh, now you're number three in the nation currently and your teammate is number one. Yeah. Is there any rivalry there? Or how do you, are you guys competing with each other? or? Sometimes we compete, but I'm pretty proud of her. <laughs> and then I'm only a few points behind her, so it's okay. She's been pretty good. Yeah, she's on a hot streak. Yes, like she's been pretty good since her freshman year. I, my peak is this year. I was doing pretty good my junior year, but my peak is this year. You're ranked number three, and you have a teammate who's ranked number one, but you have two other teammates who also must be doing pretty good. They are. Or else you They're would. really good. They just got their gold distinguished shooters badge. I really enjoy it and it's sad that I'm graduating and I'm not gonna be able to be on the team anymore, but I'm glad that I'm going out strong though. So. I'm gonna go to the University of Memphis. I actually just got my acceptance letter and I'm gonna go to ROTC there and I would like to join their marksmanship program down there. They have precision shooters, not sporter like we shoot. And I'm going to see if I can get on their team, but if not, I'm going to go through the ROTC and do four years there and then come out and go in the Navy. I've been shooting for three years. Um, started off decent, and I just got better as a okay. practice. I would say a lot of practice. Like, you, it's you need practice to get up there. Mm -hmm. Did you ever think you'd be number one? Um, I'd hope, yeah. but I didn't know. I just try really hard when I shoot. Did you uh, shoot before you joined the high school team? Were you yeah. shoot? Did you ever like shoot regular rifles and stuff? No. No, really? It was my first time shooting my freshman year, and I was just, I was so scared when I like I thought there was gonna be a kickback and everything. When you're shooting, it's mostly about experimenting with what works with your body, and I think I'm pretty good at like muscle memory and figuring out what works and what doesn't. Tell me, how does it feel to be on the number one rifle team and be the number one shooter? It's really awesome. It feels like a lot of our hard work has paid off because we practice so hard. Like if there's a competition, we're practicing every day that week. Sometimes it's really demanding and we don't want to be there, but we know it's good for us and we end up on top and it's really like, it feels good. And you must have some pretty good teammates too. Yes. All, my whole team, we're like family. We love each other. And uh, But one in particular, Josie, is number three in the nation and you're number one. Do you guys kind of feed off of each other or try to make each other better? A little bit. I'd say we're competitive with each other. Like sometimes she gets first, sometimes I do. 
it just happened that that national match I got first. Mm -hmm. It's she's awesome. <laughs> she's really good at shooting. The competition is really fierce, so I'm not always going to come in first because everyone has their good and bad days. Mm -hmm. But it was awesome getting it at nationals the yeah. last time we did. Well, I think I'm going to go to college and do the Navy scholarship where I can become an officer. So mm -hmm. I'm still looking into it. I'm really yeah, I know that you're going to think about that. Yeah.